Last week, I asked people if they started playing Rust before the EXP system or after the EXP system. It turns out that the majority of the people who participated don't even know what XP system is. So in this quick video, I will explain to you what was XP system in Rust and how it functioned. On the DevBlock 100 update, the XP system was released. Developers had this to say about then new XP system. The balance of the system has been tested a lot, but it still needs a lot more work. So it was to be expected for many things to change in regards to the XP system. Players were able to earn XP in several different ways, which included fishing, farming rocks and trees, crafting, finding crates, smashing barrels, hunting, destroying the attack helicopter, and gutting fish. Earn XP could have been used to unlock different items. I found this very old Russian site where you can see how much XP it took to unlock a wanted item. Another important system that went along the XP system was ownership. When you gathered the resources or found loot in crates and barrels, it belonged to you. The ownership of any crafted items was determined by the ownership of the resources used to craft it. Here's a quick example of ownership. If two players both gathered enough resources to make a single pickaxe, they both had a set amount of ownership of that tool. Now, whenever the pickaxe was used in gathering resources, those two players got a percentage of the XP even if they were not using the tools. As of today, the system is no longer in development and will probably never be re-added. Well, that is pretty much it with the video for today. Leave a like and subscribe to never miss another upload. And I will see you in the next video.